watching Shongda. Today I'm introducing this backpack. I've actually owned several different uh, bags before, like a shoulder bag, a uh, hard case backpack. I actually bought like a hard case and used an old inert from my other backpack and used that for a while. Uh, also had a hard case uh, shoulder or uh, hard case with a shoulder strap and also I used the Pelican. However, now I ended up with this Manfrotto backpack. It's basically the biggest version. Um, the nice feature about this is it has a one section I can quickly open to grab something out. I can basically put the camera here to quickly grab it out. However, I'd rather not do that. Basically out of safety reasons so people can't steal stuff. Basically put a lot of crap like uh, stuff I drink and stuff. Uh, maybe if I'm using the, this and I have to put something I have to carry or grab out quick, I'll probably put uh, like memory cards or just uh, some lights here so I could carry uh, grab out of it um, It's quite a nice looking bag um, The thing is why I chose this because you can't open it from the back so only from one uh, panel here and basically uh, If they want to steal your valuable camera, they can't open it directly so basically to open it is basically on the insides here so basically opening it let's see basically how it looks like basically it's quite nice because it has a lot of space for you to put stuff basically also it has space dividers and basically here you can put a small tripod I have like a very tiny tripod that I sometimes use I could put here but also for like uh, sound equipment you can put a long uh, basically a shotgun mic which is pretty long or any like boom mic here and also um, the thing is also I want to be able to put like also a bigger camera in here than just a DSLR but you have enough space for actually a lot of stuff uh, currently I basically have like it divided for like a uh, DS or DSLR camera for up here uh, if and then like a video camera and two lenses and then I don't really carry that much lenses right now uh, nowadays basically settled down for a certain lens that can basically be more used for a lot of stuff. Um, here on the other hand, on the other side, here you have like pockets. So basically here I can put my laptop and then here some pockets to put like SD cards. Mainly I put SD cards here so I can see them. And put like business cards and all kinds of stuff. Um, I chose actually, you could go for a slightly smaller version, I, this version is the Veloci V7 or uh, VII, so it's number 7, um, yeah it's pretty big, I could have gone for a slightly smaller version but it's actually okay, um, this is allowed to be carried on uh, to an airplane it's not too big and also you get like two small straps and basically you could also carry a tripod on the outer on here on the outside basically most of the time i put a monopod here and also if you want to film like uh, a POV or like a third person shot you could put a monopod here and have like a GoPro or the camera basically on your back filming over your uh, back it's quite a simple uh, backpack it, the design
design is not too outrageous it's nice simple look and also another thing is got this truck here help you if this gets heavy because with a lot of equipment uh, you want to have this one strap because it will start to get heavy and pull on your back and this keep your body straight yeah I have to say I like this Manfrotto backpack and especially this metal thing but this uh, is quite thin so I, I'm afraid it actually breaks because the clip on the bottom is plastic but the top thing is metal um, I have to say yeah for me I like this design uh, actually also the price is actually not extreme high compared to other backpacks uh, it's more of a reasonable price and it's quite a good solid backpack so that was basically it uh, hopefully you find my videos interesting if you want to see more please subscribe and if you want to tell others please do and I hope to see you next time bye bye